what is up everybody welcome back to cloud nine gaming right here on cloud nine radio you are gaming with your boy unique and today i want to help any and everyone who might be having an issue getting titanfall 2 to play on their gaming pc you might see a lock symbol on that multiplayer and i'm going to show you how or explain to you how to fix that now it took me quite a while to figure this out about two or three hours i went through every youtube video i could find went through google and really wasn't having much success i tried a million different things but there's only one thing that you really need to do and this is for those who are playing on newer gaming pcs if you have a 10th gen or above intel processor you could be coming into these issues so all you have to do guys it's real simple you're gonna to wanna to get into your system environment variables. You wanna edit your environment variables for this. So there's two ways to do it. I'm gonna post on the screen one way you could do it using the windows and the E and a bunch of steps. However, if you're like me, you like to keep things simple. Kiss it, keep it simple. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is just go into your search menu and type in the word edit. Once you type in edit, you're probably gonna see system environment variables, edit environment variables. If you don't see it, type in edit system. It will show up. Click on that. Once you're there, make sure you're under the advanced settings and then click on edit variables. This is where you gotta actually do a little bit of work and it's just a little bit, guys. All you need to do is under system variables, which will be the second set not the top, the top will be the environmental variables. So under system variables, click on new, enter your name, and then enter the value. I provided both of those in the picture so you can see them. And I'll also type it out in the comment section so you can just copy and paste if you want. Once you've entered the name and you've entered the value, click on okay. Once you click on okay, confirm that you see that name and value under system variables if you see it click on ok you are good to go guys restart your pc make sure you restart your computer once you restart your computer load up titanfall 2 and you are ready to go that is it it's a real simple solution that took me about two or three hours to figure out and find but i'm glad i found it because you will see right here in this gameplay footage from today that I was able to get in there and play on my gaming PC. One thing though, guys, with me having the game on Xbox, PS5, and now on PC, my stats are not gonna travel with me. And I know that's horrible, because it's all through EA and EA's app. And all of my accounts are linked, but my stats are not gonna carry over. So I did wanna mention that just in case you are from the Xbox community, jumping on, or if you're from the PlayStation community, jumping on just thought i'd throw that out there guys but i hope this information helps you if you have been having an issue playing titanfall 2 try this and it might help you it definitely helped me get back in the game and that's all i got for you guys can't wait to read the comments see who's playing right now and if it actually helped anybody but your boy is out peace Hostile pilot on hold.